Good evening, everybody. It's Rich and Katie down along the river. Rich's River Smokers, West Virginia. Today, what we're going to do for you is we are going to do um, some prime rib burgers we got from Walmart on the old yellow special there. And what we're going to do is we haven't used the Vortex on our kettle for a while. So we got our chimney fired up. We're not going to season in burgers or anything. I throw a couple, I pick a piece of hickory wood on a little smoke action, a little salt and pepper. Other than that, we ain't going to do much to it. So stick with us and we'll get this vortex fired up. All right, guys, here's the prime rib burgers that we're using today. We got them at Walmart for a good, good, cheap ass price. And what we're going to do, right? And what we're going to use them, and Katie had this stuff um, when, when I come back. Um, it's a Sam's Choice Apple Wood Smoked Sea Salt. Don't know. We're going to try it. And of course, McCormick's Pure Ground Black Pepper. So, we're going to get with uh, the Vortex is firing up. We'll get these things seasoned up. Here it goes. Oh. There you go. There you go. Over now, the Apple Smoked Sea Salt. Going to town. There it is. All right. Here we go. Too bad. Oh, look, too, that looks funky, doesn't it? It's brown. Brown is hard. All right, guys, we'll get these things seasoned up. You can see it in the vortex. Climbing up in temperature, we got 400 degrees on the old Weber kettle. You have to excuse it, it's been sitting outside. I don't have to wipe it down, so you got to excuse it. But we're holding about 400 degrees. And we're getting them burgers on. Hey, everybody on the back, got them burgers on. We're running about almost 450 degrees. You look at these things. So just, let's just put them on. And I know I use Applewood smoked sea salt, but I don't reckon that's going to go too far. We'd like to put a piece of hickory on the vortex. And we're gonna go ahead and get these things done. We'll see when we flip them over. Hey guys, what I failed to mention about uh, about using this vortex. When you're using smoke wood, you want to turn it a quarter turn every like five minutes or so, so if the smoke gets uh, you know smoked evenly around because the vent you know coming over the smoke. So I forgot to throw that in there. I just want to throw that in there because I keep forgetting to throw important um, barbecue facts in there like that. So again, we'll see when we flip them over. All right guys, we just flip them burgers. And here what we got. Look at them. They look pretty good. Smoked burgers. Not on a hard cook. But man, and prime ribs, they look pretty good. So, we'll get you back when we start. We'll do a taste test. Everybody, look at these burgers. I mean, the hickory smoke on them. The applewood, sea salt, and some black pepper. Got some American cheese and Swiss cheese. We're going to go ahead and tear off a piece of these burgers because we're waiting on some french fries. Miss Katie is uh, frying some french fries and texting. And we got french fries <laughs> on the hizzy. So we're going to go ahead and give you a taste test of these burgers. And we're back. Tell you what, I was going to about a piece of I don't know whose burger this will be. So probably Dodge and Grace's. Man. Oh man, oh man. You smell that, the hickory smoke. Yeah, I'll tell you what, it's got a nice little smoke ring on it. I don't know if you can pick it up right there. Nice little smoke ring. So, the applewood smoked sea salt and some black pepper on a hickory wood on the vortex. Mm. Mm. Tell you what. Oh wow. Burger's a little dry, but tell you what, that's good stuff. That's good stuff, guys. Let me tell you. If you know where to get that Sam's Choice uh, hickory applewood smoked sea salt, get you some. But I'm not gonna go without telling you. 
You gotta get some of this too. Rich's River Dirt. Check it out. HeavenMadeProducts.com. Get you some. You know, I know the season's almost over. But get you some and work the hell out of it. So, we're gonna get to eating. We're gonna make a burger or two. And I just wanna say thanks for all the support. All my social... Uh, all my social media links will be in the description box. It's show more. And all my um, feel links in the description box. It's show more. And guys, if you feel like donating to the cause, my PayPal link is down there as well. Take a good look at that. It's accepted, but not expected. And very well appreciated if you do. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this cook on the Vortex with the burgers. We're going to get down on these things. And guys, share with your friends and family. And when you do... Tell them that the best barbecue comes from the river. And we'll see you on the next one.